Three million dollars in the last 30 days with TikTok shop. Goalie, a company that just started selling on TikTok, was able to pull this off. Now, the crazy part is they did it using a brand new strategy that I believe has completely disrupted TikTok forever. Now, these are some big claims, so let's get right into it. So I put together a full deep dive going over Goalie's TikTok shop strategy, and I'm going to go over all of it with you guys. But before I do, I want to go over the numbers. So here we are inside of Calo data. And as you can see, Goalie currently has the number one top selling product on TikTok shop right now. Their ashwagandha gummies have sold 57,000 units and have generated over $760,000 in revenue in the last seven days, which is just crazy. Now, looking at even more specifics, we can see that in the last 30 days, Goalie has generated over $3.1 million in revenue. Now, the reason why Goalie stands out compared to all other TikTok shops is because one, they don't have any big celebrity figures behind them. Two, they weren't even active on TikTok shop even a month ago, right? They just started selling on TikTok shop in July. And as you can see, they were only doing a few thousand dollars a day. Fast forward to this month, they're now doing over a hundred thousand dollars a day. And they've had even some days where they've done over $300,000 in sales, which is just crazy. Now, there's a lot of things that Goldie has done right, but I believe the main reason why they have had such explosive growth is because they have taken a brand new approach to TikTok shop. And that's what we're going to cover in today's video. So let's dive in. So the first thing I want to go over is just their TikTok shop setup. Now, I'm not going to cover the technicals of their TikTok shop or how they did it. I mainly want to go over their product listing. So here, when you look at their product listing, you can see that they have a very well put together product listing. First off, if you look at their images, they're all very clean and very well put together. You'll notice that this first image here, it highlights authority showing off that they're America's number one ashwagandha vitamin gummy brand. Here you can see the gummies. Then they have this uh, this other sticker here that says B certified. I'm not even sure exactly what that means, but it just looks like you know official and obviously it provides them with a lot more authority. Here, if you look at the bottom, they have this overlay that says add three to cart and get it for $11 each, which obviously it lets people know that they can get a discount if they add more to their cart, which ends up helping out with the average order value. Then here they have some of the um, key benefits and features of the product. Then if you keep scrolling through, you'll notice that, again, they have very well put together product images that all serve a purpose, right? They have lifestyle photos. They have here, again, more benefits, the product, features, social proof, and more, right? So overall, um, the product images are just very clean, very well put together. Next, if you have their title, again, a very straightforward title that has ashwagandha gummies, some of the features. And then here at the bottom, again, they're claiming America's number one ashwagandha gummy brand, which is, that's a bit, pretty big claim. If you keep scrolling, then you'll see uh, customer reviews. And then here you'll see more about the product. So then again, you'll see more social proof. The fact that they have sold over 90 million bottles of gummy vitamins. You'll see some lifestyle photos, some more social proof, and obviously then they have more. So overall, this is a very well put together product listing on TikTok shop. If you ever wanted to get any ideas, I think you can use them as a reference because they're doing a lot of things right here. Now, moving on, their products, they decided to start off with mainly their top selling products, which is the uh, ashwagandha gummies, their apple cider vinegar gummies, and their sleep gummies. Now, what's also interesting is that they also decided to roll out packs of their products. So for example, you can buy a pack of three of the ashwagandha gummies, or you can buy their best sellers pack, which is their ashwagandha gummies, their apple cider vinegars, and this matcha mine gummies. The next thing I want to go over is Goalie's TikTok launch incentives. So this is what's responsible for Goalie's explosive growth. Before launching, they announced that they were going to launch with these incentives that affiliates and creators could earn on top of their commissions. And this is what's solely responsible for their explosive growth. So they were the very first to ever roll out anything like this. And basically the way that it works is if a affiliate promotes products for Goalie and they generate any of these different tiers of sales, they would automatically win these prizes. So for example, if an affiliate comes in and they generate $4,000 worth of sales for Goalie, they automatically win an iPhone. If they generate $5,000 worth of sales, they get a Miami retreat. If you generate $7,000 in sales, you get a MacBook Pro all the way to if you generate $500,000 in sales, you get a 2024 Tesla Model 3, a MacBook Pro and a Miami retreat. Now, obviously, this is just leading with massive reward and it can actually come off as maybe a little bit scammy. And so to 
um, make this official, what they actually did is they went around and connected with different TikTok shop communities and they held a Twitter space where they announced that they were in fact doing this. The actual team from Goalie um, came on and said that this was legit because obviously it can come off as like maybe a scam, right? And so they wanted to solidify it. And so what they did is before they even launched this, they started sharing like all of these insights about Goalie. Like they rolled out again, this incentive giveaway, how you can earn more with Goalie, uh, their overall mission statement, how they wanted to be the number one top selling brand on TikTok shop. And they wanted to really um, provide a way for affiliates to be incentivized to help them do that. And so they rolled this out. And one of the things that they did that I think helped a lot with this is that they built anticipation around this. So they went live with this in August here, as you can see. And before they even went live, they had already announced their incentives and the exact prizes. And they had already started like going live, verifying the fact that this was actually happening. So obviously, you know, before even like really going live with this incentive launch, affiliates already knew that this was legit. And they already knew that they were already going to be able to start creating content to start earning some of these prizes. And so I thought that first off, rolling this out and building anticipation around this launch played a huge component to this. Like obviously it got people excited before even getting started, you know, with this launch to want to promote for goalie. So that's one. Next is they were the very first TikTok shop to ever launch any type of like incentives on top of the commissions offered. Because the way that this works is the affiliates, they still earn their normal commissions, but they also get these rewards on top, which is just crazy. Goalie right now is taking the tried and true affiliate launch playbook that has worked for over a decade and they're applying it to TikTok shop on a massive scale. That's exactly what this is. And so by doing this, I think that this helped them combat the overall competition because right now the current landscape on TikTok shop is very competitive. There are more brands coming in every single day and there's only a limited amount of creators and affiliates, especially the talented ones. And so this helps really break through the noise because now if you have affiliates that were previously promoting for any other TikTok shop brand that's only offering them commissions and they now come across this incentive from Goalie and they realize that they can one, earn the same commissions, if not maybe even more because they're also offering pretty high commissions. You can see here, they're offering 25% commissions, which is pretty high for TikTok shop. And they could also earn an additional incentive. Well, they're going to be a lot more open to work with Goalie compared to whatever other TikTok shop brand they're working with. And so I believe that this is obviously a big reason why Goldie was able to, from day one, break through the noise and really stand out compared to the rest of the competition. And another thing that I realized is that Goldie strategically created these incentives that would attract specifically TikTok shop affiliates, because majority of the affiliates that are on TikTok shop, they're millennials and they're both male and female. And so if you look at these incentives, they're all prizes that any millennial, regardless on whether you're a male or a female would want, which I thought was genius because now this is um, applicable to majority of the affiliates on TikTok. Now, the last thing that I thought was pretty genius by Goalie is the fact that they added urgency to the incentives. So you can see here that they made it very clear that you can only participate from the beginning of August to the 11th, but then they changed it and they said, hey, you guys can participate from the beginning of August until the end of the month. But the fact that they gave a specific timeline is part of the reason why specifically in August, they saw such explosive growth. And so I love the fact that they leveraged in some urgency because again, if you just leave this open and you say, hey, you can participate anytime, there's no real incentive as to why people should participate right now. And so obviously this is why when you look at the growth that Goldie has had, it's so explosive, right? When we look at this, this chart, it literally goes from like barely any activity to just explosive growth. This is mainly because of the incentives, but also because of the urgency that they're adding into this. So I wanted to obviously um, make sure I spent enough time going over these incentives because I believe that this has completely changed the game for TikTok shop and how brands on TikTok shop are going to operate moving forward, right? There now is going to be a lot more competition from brands that are rolling out incentives like this compared to brands that are just offering the normal commissions like everybody else. So wanted to obviously cover that, but it does not stop there. So very quickly, when it comes to creator sourcing, Goalie did work with an agency. And so for a lot of their you know, sourcing of creators, this was handled for them. But also to be fair, 
it was fairly easy to attract creators when you have these kinds of incentives. And so if you see here in the last 30 days, they have worked with over 4,000 creators, which for a new brand on TikTok shop is completely unheard of. They're just setting records across the board. But yeah, they did work with an agency to source all the creators. Next is for the creator onboarding and management. They also worked with an agency for this. But one of the things that they did is they did do a very good job at the pre-product arrival and preparation. So as you can see here, before even creators receive their products and before even starting off with these uh, incentives and the overall giveaways, they prepared everybody with you know, insights on goalie overall, right? How long they've been around for, how many they've sold in the past. Like you can see here, like they've sold over 90 million bottles. They've um, had over 400,000 reviews on Amazon. They're America's number one apple cider vinegar and ashwagandha brand. Like they just provided all these fun facts that provided context on goalie and the brand as a whole. Also, they provided everybody with, again, these important do's and don'ts so they can make sure that they stay compliant with their messaging and what they can and cannot say. And so, yeah, they obviously did a really good job with providing a comprehensive brand guide overall. Also, the agency that they worked with also provided insights on current trends, which plays a big role. And then the last thing they did to prepare is they provided examples of the best and worst top performing videos. So when it comes to TikTok shop, you don't need to reinvent the wheel. You can find videos that have gone viral before and have gotten really good reach and have generated a lot of sales for another product in the category and just recreate that video, but for your product that you're promoting. And so obviously, you know, there's a lot of preparation that goes into working with the creators before they even receive the products. But yeah, I mean, these are just uh, some of the key things that I came across that they did before uh, starting to create content. Now, moving forward to content creation. Again, they worked with an agency. So a lot of this process was covered and worked on with the creators and affiliates by the agency. But there are some insane stats that I came across from their growth. And here are some of them right here. So I'll run through these very quickly because I have one more thing that I want to cover with you guys. Now, the first is they generated $3.1 million from affiliates. So majority of their revenue that came in in the last 30 days or in their first month was almost all from affiliates. They generated $2.6 million from one single product. Their ashwagandha gummies is really responsible for majority of the sales that they generated. As you can see here, they generated $384,000 in revenue from one single affiliate. So if you look through breakdown from their affiliates, you can see that again, in the last 30 days, one affiliate alone was responsible for all this revenue. They generated $363,000 from one single creator video. If you look through here and we scroll down to the different videos, you can see that again, one video was responsible for all of this revenue. Next is they generated $15,000 from one two hour live stream. So if you scroll down here, you can see that one live stream ran for two hours, made $15,000. Next is they generated $862,000 from the top five affiliates combined. So if you look through their affiliates, the top five affiliates contributed a significant amount of their total revenue. So majority of their affiliates are micro creators with accounts that have less than 70,000 followers, which is crazy because this just goes to show you don't need to work with very large content creators or very large affiliates to actually get good results with TikTok shop. So these are some of the main insane stats that I saw that came from all the content that they have put out so far. Now, the next thing I want to go over is how they scaled with paid ads. So what we do with our own e-commerce business and for all the other e-commerce businesses that we work with is anytime that we have a video that goes viral and generates a significant amount of sales organically, we then take the top performing videos and then we run them as paid ads. And so if you look through their Calo data and the videos that they have, you can see that any video that has this purple sticker that says ad on the top left corner is a video that they're pushing with paid ads. So you can see that they have a handful of their videos that have generated majority of the revenue that they're pushing with paid ads. And obviously this has also played a very big role as to how some of these videos have generated this much revenue. So obviously, you know, scaling organically works really well across many of affiliates, but also scaling with paid ads can push you to the next level, which is exactly why they did it. Now, these are some of the main takeaways that I got from Goalie's TikTok shop strategy and how they were able to go from zero to over $3 million on TikTok shop in their first month. And obviously this strategy works. And the reason I say that is because Goalie has decided to double down this upcoming month and they decided to roll out the same incentive campaign, but with even crazier incentives. 
right? As you can see here now, if you generate $1,500 in sales, you get an iPad. If you generate $4,000 in sales, you get an iPhone 15, an Apple Watch, and a DJI Osmo Mobile. Now, here's where it gets crazy. If you generate $950,000 in sales, you get a Lamborghini Urus, you get an all-inclusive trip to Aruba, you get a MacBook Pro, an iPad, an Apple Watch, an iPhone 15, a DJI Osmo, and a three-month retainer. Or you can choose to get $316,000 in cash, right? And then the highest reward, if you generate $1.2 million, you get a condominium in Brickell, Miami, you get a Cedo Spark, you get a MacBook Pro, an iPad, an Apple Watch, an iPhone 15, a DJI Osmo, and a three-month retainer. Or you can choose for $525,000 in cash. They're just going overboard with this, right? They obviously saw like, hey, this works. And we were able to very quickly generate over $3 million our first month in. And so let's increase the overall incentives, right? And let's just take it to a whole nother level. And that's exactly what they did here. Now, obviously, other TikTok shops are seeing that this is working really well for Goalie. And there have also been other TikTok shops that have started to roll out similar incentives. As you can see here, this other brand, Nello, which if you go on TikTok, you can see that they have currently the number four top selling product on TikTok shop right now. It's a powder drink. I believe these are electrolytes. And you can see that they rolled out their own TikTok prizes, right? Because of course this works, right? And so you can see that they're modeling after a goalie and they rolled out their own incentive structures. They also added in the, the dates. So this is for now in September. And uh, here are more specifics, here are more details. And so overall, like I said, I believe that this has completely changed the game for the TikTok shop ecosystem. I believe the game of coming in on TikTok shop and just offering normal commissions like everybody else has been doing is over. And so this is something that we're going to be doing for the business that we run, but also for all the other e-commerce businesses that we work with. Because again, it makes sense with this, as long as you set up the incentives that are aligned with your business's profit margins. This is only a win-win, right? You're literally getting paid up front. You're making all the sales up front and you're paying out the prizes after. And so there's literally no way you can lose unless you obviously don't create the incentives aligned with your actual profitability of the business. And so obviously I think that this is going to be a complete game changer. I love the fact that, you know, brands are coming on here and they're rolling out these kinds of incentives because it just overall adds in a different layer to what's possible with TikTok shop. Some final thoughts here. Goalie has fundamentally shifted the standards for TikTok shop and the overall ecosystem. With the current landscape, again, there were more brands currently joining TikTok shop than there are affiliates to support all these brands. And so the competition is fierce and it's there. Behind the scenes, some of the smaller e-commerce businesses that we work with are actually struggling to consistently onboard new affiliates to work with them and promote their products. And the reason why is because, again, they're just offering the normal 15% off commissions that almost every other TikTok shop brand is offering. My girlfriend is on TikTok shop and she's actually a pretty decent sized affiliate for one of the top selling products on TikTok shop. And she shows me her direct messages. She gets over a hundred messages a day from many of these different TikTok shop brands offering her the same commissions to promote their products. And so I believe that the space overall needed a breakthrough like this. And obviously Goalie was the first one to really roll this out. And they rolled this out very strategically, right? Everything from the exact prizes that were chosen to how they added in the urgency and the timeline of when you can participate to earn those prizes. Like everything was done strategically and obviously Internally, we're taking a lot of the insights that we learn from analyzing Goalie's TikTok shop strategy and, and we're going to be rolling that out across our own e-commerce business, but also across all the other e-commerce businesses that we work with. And so I believe that this is going to change the game for the better, to be honest, because now smaller e-commerce businesses will be able to create their own uh, incentive structure just like this. And this can work for any business because obviously you can set the incentives based on the amount of sales that you want to hit that make it profitable for you to actually give out these incentives. And so I believe that this now will allow more businesses to actually uh, capture more market share on TikTok shop compared to before where it was just majority of the same top selling products on TikTok shop that attracted almost all of the affiliates. So 
I do think that this will change the landscape for the better as long as uh, you obviously utilize this for your own e-commerce business. Now, one other thing that I wanted to add is right now, we're only looking at the direct results from the sales generated during this incentive launch. However, all the videos that were already posted for Goalie, these videos will continue to generate sales even after the incentives uh, are over, right? And they have an active presence on TikTok. So now all of this awareness that has been generated on TikTok will spill over to their Amazon sales to their retail sales, to their direct website sales and more. And so I think that this was a genius play. Obviously, you know, it's not easy for every single business to roll out something like this, but again, you can do it at your own scale. So these are some of my main takeaways from Goalie's TikTok shop strategy. Moving forward, I will be looking to implement as much of these learnings and insights as I can for my own e-commerce business but also for all the other e-commerce businesses that we work with. If you run an e-commerce business and you're looking to get help with TikTok shop, down below this video, there's gonna be a link down below in the description where you can actually book in a call with me and my team. And on that call, we can get to know more about you and your business and we can actually strategize on TikTok shop. Now, as always, if you guys enjoyed this video, I would appreciate if you dropped a like. If you have any questions about anything that I covered in the video, drop them down below in the comments. And of course, if you haven't already, make sure you subscribe to the channel.